fucked up well, earlier. The begin the drive begin to give errors. So well, it's already sign it's gonna give up soon. And well, from the inside, one key is missing. I already ordered that, so that's coming. Well, the church board. I still gotta order that one. Just gotta order a completely new DC board. There. This one is a bit well. It's really crappy and always gets way too hot. And something new. For the hard disk replacement, I'm gonna put in an SSD. And this thing is capable of 500 megabytes a second. Although it's probably gonna accept 250 or so. Plus, at least I can just do everything on this thing. And it's gonna be fast, so I'm pretty curious on how fast it will boot then. Because of this drive as well. It, those things won't live forever, so to speak. And when you are going to school, this laptop is going to get a bit bashed around, of course. It has some better days, but it's still, well, it works fine. And when I'm getting a new laptop, I can still put this thing in, so well, that ain't really a problem. And the new DC board for the charger is around 18 euros out of my head. It ain't the best one, it's a imitation one, but I'm not going to spend too much money on this thing, since you can get these on pretty good condition for 200 euros or something. So the half, the half of it is already spent on the SSD. Yes, it's a bit overkill, but <laughs> it's gonna be fun. And it's gonna be fast. So that's good. So I'll just do a speed test on my MacBook from the oh, the drive now, how fast it is, and then I'll do a speed test on this one. It's probably gonna take a few days for me, because if I have to reinstall everything. Since yeah, the old OS is still pretty slow, there are a lot of items on there, so I'm just gonna well install a new OS. It's a bit better than, well, keeping the old one. Which is already getting a bit slower from all the files. Since editing does leave, well, some files around, of course. So yeah, but, uh, I'll show you how fast uh, my MacBook now is. So yeah, one second. Okay guys, it's the speed test and I'm recording this via my phone, since if I'm recording it in my laptop self, it will, well, uh, the speed is going to be a bit less. And, uh, wow. My hard drive is really to its end. It really, really, really is. Read this a bit faster. Oh, gosh. This is pretty terrible. This is really bad. 13 and a half or 18. Wow. It normally is around, well, 40 or 50. It should be. But as you can see, it's just, <laughs> my drive is fucked up. Just look at that, guys. Those darn speeds, 707. That's not fast at all. It's terrible. This thing should be capable of 200 megabytes a second, at least. So I'm pretty curious what it will do when I got a new SSD. But yeah, that's the speed test, it won't get much better. Read is, well, it's not too much, and write. Still sucks. Yeah. But uh, I'll install a new disk and then you will see.
Well, okay, guys. So that was some testing and everything. Now, well, I'm pretty happy I bought that SSD because, well, if I just want to open my system preferences, how fast is it? Maybe one close to one second. Safari is about the same. So it's pretty damn quick now. That really is. So I'm pretty happy I have it now. And I have Windows on it too now. So now I got 100 gigabytes on the disk. Well, different. And that one just opens in a second. So this one is for Windows, it's a partition. As you can see here, so this one is for Windows and this one is just for my, well, Mac. And still is 170 gigabytes, well, no, 120 gigabytes more than the old drive. So, I'm pretty happy with that. And I also got Windows 10 now, so this is great since I needed that for my school. So, that's pretty nice, I guess. So, I got everything now. So, I'm happy. So is it worth getting this SSD or any SSD in an old MacBook? Well, it kind of is. It just make it really fast, and this thing isn't obsolete yet. It isn't too bad. So yeah, as you can see, these are some specs. The graphics, well, no, they ain't the best, but <laughs> it still does play Minecraft and does render uh, of video files and everything. So that ain't too bad. And the dual core 2.4 GHz ain't too bad either. Well, it ain't new, but yeah, it still works great in that sense. So, yeah. So, uh, I'm pretty happy now. So, uh, yeah. But uh, I'll see you guys next time. So, uh, see ya.